good morning. Good morning. It is a very wet and mucky Sunday morning in Wiltshire. Daisy's having a bit of a cuddle with Star. And um, we've just finished a bit of work and we are off out. It's chucking it down outside, but we have got some tickets for a pre-season day at Chesington. So we've got our Merlin annual passes and we are heading on out. So we will see you in a bit. See you later. Meow. <laughs> right, we are all aboard the fun bus. It is horrible. It is. It is very gloomy. However, we have got our tickets. Um, no idea what to expect on this. This has been put together by a company called Eventbrite. And I only heard about this because I saw something on Twitter, somebody complaining that they weren't being able to get their uh, annual pass holder pre-season tickets for Chesington. Um, and then I started looking into it, went down a bit of a hole with it, found where to get the tickets, got the tickets. Came through very, very quickly. So I've got no idea what this is. I'm assuming it's like a smaller access um, to Chesington. So we'll see what it's like when we get there. But I can't remember the last time we went to Chesington. I can't remember. So um, I remember liking it a lot. Um, so yeah, we are just putting the uh, postcode into the sat nav. It's quarter past 10. Um, I think it's gonna take about an hour and a half to get there. So we will see you at Chesington. We are here. We're here. It has just gone 11.35. That was a well good journey. Very good. Yeah, uh, the car park seems a little bit convoluted. We keep getting pointed to different spaces, but probably because it's not a standard day. So we have got our tickets. Uh, we've got our coats because it looks a bit mucky. And we are going to head on in. So we're heading in. It looks kind of quiet. It does. I mean, it, it should be probably. Yeah. I haven't been in for ages. Don't recognise anything. So we're all in, that was nice and easy. Very easy, yeah. Yeah, really just good. scan the Merlin Pass and we're into the park already. It feels really light and very unfamiliar. I think it might be sort of eight or 10 years since we've been here. So we're gonna take a slow mooch around, have a look around. Yeah. So we don't know what this is, Trail of the Kings heading on in. How are you feeling? A bit nervous. Oh, yeah. yeah. It's the uh, anticipation of the unknown. What is really nice, as soon as you come in, the theme park music's through, I'm getting all the feels. How majestic. Or oh, <laughs> just heard a lion roar. <laughs> Big boy. What do you think of the theme in? I think something's gonna fall on my head. I'm slightly nervous. Kind of reminds me of the Brunner and Zookeeper. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that is a good film. So I think we're firmly on some sort of animal trail. What do you think? Uh, I love animals. <laughs> I think there's going to be some meerkats. Blooming hope so. <laughs> so we've got here then, Days. So we've got the uh, bush door. Oh, Richard Fr Oh, no. I thought that's a Sitifrica. <laughs> Sitifrica. <laughs> I can't do uh, American. South America, it's like Brazil. <laughs> Why am I still Australian slash New Zealand slash South Africa? So we're in the lion bit. These guys are magnificent. And it's really cool that you can get fairly close. Yeah, super cool. I've seen a load of these. Africa. In fact, I think I've seen several. <laughs> Get in! Daisy's just pointed out these little scratch marks as you're coming out. It's nice little details like this. They did, well, basically proves that they can get out of there. <laughs> um, that's like a little walkthrough with all the different animals. Really, really impressed. The music's pumping through, you've got all like, the animal noises coming through. So far, well impressed. So where are we? We've seen some sea lions. <laughs> We've just come out of the lion bit and uh, there's a sea lion show that's going to start in four minutes. I wasn't expecting, I forgot that this used to be a zoo, um, but this looks really cool. Oh my gosh. I'm getting all the fields, Daisy. A bit of Baywatch. It's a bit of Baywatch. Hannah Anderson will be out in a minute, even the seagulls come to watch. <laughs> behaviors are really to get them moving around, get them working those muscles um, and uh, also working their brains as well because with them being such a 
to say, we're continuously kind of working at the Sea Lions' paces. You know, sometimes they have good days where they're really sort of engaged and they're really interested in the training. That's so cute. <laughs> So that's a sea lion bit done, what do you think? That was really good, I love sea lions, they're so cute. Cool. They're really cute. The thing is like, they're doing like flips and dad was saying he can't even teach the cat how to <laughs> not scratch the cat. <laughs> yeah, it was really, really cool. The guy that did the talk, um, super knowledgeable, super friendly. It wasn't the normal talk, I think it um, stays mainly geared for annual pass holders. They're just giving you a bit of info of what they've been doing over the last year and how they cleaned all the pool, but so far, really good. Yeah, Daisy's really just good. checking the map out. We're winging it a bit today because we don't know the park, so I think we're just going to hop on stuff as we come across it. So, what are we going on now? Pick a gruffalo around. Yeah. We're going to hop on it. This is really cool. And that is the vampire up there. We'll probably see that go around in a second. Do you know what to expect on this? I have no idea. Excited. Very excited. It's lovely in here. It's really nice. Yeah. So we're on the Gruffalo. When we get on the ride, I don't like the fact that it's got a plug hole at the bottom of the boat. But the queue was so lovely. So cute. Gruffalo merch in here, days. <laughs> what you got there? <laughs> I can't. You do like ears, don't you? I can't. <laughs> you seen the other one? Oh. oh, yeah, that's cool. Right, Daisy, thoughts on the Gruffalo? I'm sorry, that, that was really good. <laughs> That, so cute. that was really cute. I absolutely loved that. I think that's. It was very Disney. It was very, it was Disney. very Disney. High quality ride. Everything was awesome. So now we're going to hop on to the vampire. 30 minute wait. Daisy's never done this, and I did this like back in the day. You excited for vampire? We're heading in, Daisy. 30 minutes. Are you tall enough? <laughs> How are you feeling? What do you think? That's really good. Really good. Freaking bats. I love Halloween. Very flipping cool. That's good, wasn't it? That's a vampire then. It's really good. It was really quick. It was quick, wasn't it? Yeah. And that ride is properly old and it really stands up. The loading area is cool. We were getting some serious Lost Boys vibes on that. I know, got on there singing I Still Believe, brilliant. Yeah, and the cast members that are like loading and offloading are just having so much fun. It was, I am loving Chesington. Really good. Yeah, really good. I like it. Time for a coffee, Dezo. Yes. This area is really nice. <laughs> we currently find ourselves at our normal perching point by the bins. Got some coffees on the go. How's your muffin? It's, um, you know, it's got everything in it. <laughs> some blueberries, you know, got some texture. It's got everything you wanted in a muffin. And we're in a really, really lovely, like, picnic area, and I think there must be some sort of muff muffalo. <laughs> it's because you had a muffin. Gruffalo <laughs> meet and greet. 
But although it's a little bit overcast and a bit chilly, it is really, really good here. I'm well impressed. So we're gonna finish our coffees and uh, carry on. We're running blind a bit here, so we're just making our way around. So what do you reckon? I'm excited. Safari Sagudi. Yeah, Safari Sagudi. Getting some lovely Africa vibes from here. Got a nice bit of music, Daisy's got a jam on. Vibing. Bit of a totem pole. Very nice. So we're getting in the queue. I think this is going to be a bit like the Kilimanjaro safaris. Mm. Quaharini. Quaharini. Good boy for now. Go well. Go well. We're going in the caves. We've just done the Zufari. What do you think, Daze? Well, we see some giraffes, but it was quite cold, so I don't think anything else was out. <laughs> and we queued for quite a while. So we queued for nearly an hour for that. That ride takes about four or five minutes and just whizzes around. Yeah. It's a shame, really, because they could do a lot with that if they had like more places to go. And looks like Tracy's been out driving again. Daisy's just made a bit, bit of a good point, maybe being a little bit harsh. I think what they've tried to do is something fairly similar to Kilimanjaro Safari, uh, Safari at Animal Kingdom. Mm. It's a bit like that, the vehicles are the same, but it's just not very long. Um, you sort of go around the giraffe enclosure, you get nice and close to the giraffes, that was cool. Yeah, but saying that, if you've like, never seen a giraffe before and you've like, got kids who want to see a giraffe, that's perfect. Yes, it and is perfect. Also, kids don't have a very long attention span. Yeah. But it's, it's just the queue doesn't match the length of the ride. Yeah, fair point, Daisy. I may, might have been a little bit um, harsh on that, but yeah, someone's definitely been to Animal Kingdom and come back with some ideas. It's called Tomb Blaster. What do you reckon? No, I don't it's a 10 minute wait. That is going straight in my basket. That was Tomb Blaster. That was so good. That was I, really good. I had good. no idea what to expect and I didn't know what it was, but yeah, I'm a bit salty because Dad got a bit of school, but you know, it's fine. <laughs> it was, um, yeah, it's like a shooting game, so you get a little lazy on and go around, but it's massive inside and it's a bit creepy. It, yeah, it's a little bit jumpy, but I did like it a lot. Yeah, I liked yeah, it a lot. Really Would recommend to a friend. But yeah, really, really good. Lots of mummies and serpents and sort of Egyptian scary stuff coming out of you. Really, really good. Loved it. It's a bit rainy now, so I think we're going to go and wash our hands and see if we can find something to eat. It's perfectly fine and she can still eat um, loads of food, so she that's it fine. See, so you're hoping to get a breeding pair How of cool. tigers, uh, and that will How be cool that. That? get the female to stand up nice and high. We'll make sure that all of her teeth are nice and full, and that all the cubs are feeding from her. As so they're giving a little like conservation uh, yeah. talk um, about the tigers. It's really, really cool, and they're sort of crossing over on a bridge. Um, yeah, wasn't expecting any of this. I'm well impressed. Yeah, that was really cool. It was really I cool. To touch it. Yeah, Tracy would have loved that. Tracy loves tigers. So because it's a bit grim weather-wise, we've decided against the log flume. I think we made the right choice, Days. Right. Yeah. But this whole area down here is really, really nice. It looks it looks really new and yeah, I'm really impressed so far. Yeah, I'm really enjoying it. Then. Yeah. Shame it. I think if you came here and the weather was really, really nice, yeah, crack it day. Yeah. But it's raining and it's still lovely. Yeah, it's still like. Yeah. Have you ever been that close to a tiger? I've never been that close to a tiger. How do you feel? Uh, I feel like I can do anything. Do you feel terrific? Don't do That's that. what Tony the tiger says. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's a bit spinny for us. That is a fancy looking, what is that? A mer is that a merry-go-round or a carousel? It's a merry-go-round because it's not just horses. Ah, oh, fun fact. I don't know, I might be wrong. It's got very sort of tree of life-esque, isn't it? Where are we off to now? 
gift shop. What do you like? A gift shop. Let's go in the gift shop. Yes. <laughs> One hundred and twenty. Oh, it was a hundred and. It was one hundred and twenty-five. But it was. Look at the bargain. You haven't a giraffe. <laughs> why is it so long? Is that soft. So soft, but like, why is? It's quite disturbing. Oh, fun fact: Capybara. It's the world's biggest rodent. It is. I There's no swim. joke here. There's not I a joke. Can, swim. can they? Yeah. Oh, nice. I have it. No. Oh, I loved him in Pulp Fiction. Tim Sloth. So as you come out of the gift shop, this whole sort of area looks like where you get your sweets, your donuts. There's like a smokehouse restaurant, pizza, pasta, and it's all around this carousel bit. It's a nice area, this. Yeah. So this ride looks like the sort of ride where you get on it thinking, oh, this is going to be fine. And then it just speeds up. Look at the, that dad regretting <laughs> But he, he just went. <laughs> so we, here we have the world's bravest magpie. <laughs> Oh, you know what his name is? No, don't Ray. Be this joke. No. Ray Liotta. All right. Fine. This is such a cool little area. I just love watching such small animals tackle such a massive fish. Yeah, he is all over that fish. This is really cool. There's loads of them. Thank you. We're all back in the fun bus. Yeah. That was a really really good day at Chesington yeah it was really good yeah, yeah. we haven't been there for <laughs> such a long time it's wet it's cold and um, there were more people uh, there than I thought there would be for like um, an annual pass holders preview day but it was fantastic really really liked it I like the mix between like all the animals and the rides as well yeah what did you think I really enjoyed it I like yeah I liked all the animals because I like animals yeah and um yeah the rides we did were really good even though we didn't do many but it was raining so it just sort of didn't wanna... my favorite ride of the day without a doubt was the gruffalo ride it's amazing it it's is so absolutely fantastic and that i think it's a new ride there um but it is just quality i think mm. it's definitely got disney vibes you yeah. know the quality of the projections and the boat mechanism the way it goes around the smells on yeah, there the smells are really good i just loved it yeah and we, we as we're pass holders we're going to be back at chesington a whole bunch more hopefully with better weather hopefully with tracy and luke um but yeah it felt it felt like we would just scratch the surface of chesington mm. today so we will be back soon hope you enjoyed this if you did please like and subscribe and that's it from us today cheers, cheers.